and I can let it absorb some kind of rays while it's hanging out. Let's see here. All right, guys, it's been a while since I checked in with you. Uh, Steve-O's here, came out to, to hang out for a little bit. He's got to work tomorrow, so he's not staying the night. Um, but we're going to cook up some food and uh, have a little bit of a good time. So I brought us, what did you bring us? Bag or fire. Uh, hard to show you, especially on camera. Let's see if we can get a good shot of this. Let's see. All right, guys. Bag of fire. There we go. All right. See how it goes. We got some birch bark on top. And then we have uh, the little chemical down there beside it. Well, you can completely 100% cook off of it. Um, from what the instructions say, is this stuff supposed to burn at almost 1,000 degrees. These little logs are actually made out of a, uh, almost like hickory. All right. Uh, don't worry about skirt. You on the paint. There you go. That's a little bit smoother. Alright right, guys, we're going to give this a shot. Got birch bark on top, we're going to light it with the fire steel, and then the flame should kick this stuff up. So, there we go. Move it, move it, move it. Alright. Let's get a, let's get a close up in here. He lit the uh, birch bark that we sat on top of that chemical with the uh, fire steel and then we're setting the logs that come in the bag all around it uh, so it looks like a slow burning thing almost like a Swedish torch That's kind of going. it does, it does, it does that's pretty neat Uh, I really should have made a fry pot. God damn it. Huh? Don't do anything dumb. Oh, I always do something dumb. Well, you're on camera, so don't do anything dumb. Oh, mm. is that bad? Or if I'm that hungry? <laughs> I mean, they're a little burnt, but gives it that char taste to it. Mm. Nice little soy patty. Uh, got all your veggies right here in it too. Ooh. It's always amazed me how stainless steel never actually stays all nice and pretty like that. Mm -hmm. Could be like uh, clean steel one day and black and steel the next. Very much. And you can't get it off. No. Like stainless steel, my ass. Mm -hmm. I really, really should change my chopper. But I'm not going. Go from there and move them over here. Stay by the fire in my little chair. Until I'm ready to go to bed, and then I'll bank it with some thicker pieces. You know, we're cooking up some food. He brought some food out, but we're gonna go ahead and set this up underneath the tarp real quick. I'm gonna show you my sleep system uh, that I'm gonna use. Went and got a. I'm gonna try this out. It's a Magellan mummy bag. Uh, Inside, I have a sleep pad right here, a uh, Magellan bag. I'm going to go ahead and pull them out. Normally, I don't pull these things out, guys, until it's about ready to uh, pass out, but we're going to set this up and see how it looks.
So I should be pretty comfy cozy. I'm probably not going to want to get out in the morning. Um, I'll film half the morning from my, from my comfy cozy little spot here <laughs> before I get started. So all set up, all ready to go. Wrap that around there. And uh, yeah, there we go. That's uh, that's all there is to it, guys. Set that up. I should be fairly warm right there. So, hey, is this Baja Blast wine? Yeah. Oh my goodness. So, Steven got. got me Baja Blast. What I, me. what I did figure out about the Baja Blast is, is uh, up in Asheville, uh, North Carolina, it doesn't exist. You know, it's always nice when I show up and it's a surprise because then it's just even better. And now and then I get this. <laughs> Well, it's going to be. It's lie. supposed to be cold tonight. I don't want you going to bed hungry. You need a hot meal to go to sleep on. Very true. Very true. I appreciate it. <laughs> Funny thing about these things, guys, uh, tidbit, is the type of container they're in, you not can, paper, right? You can refill it with water. You can refill it with water, exactly. Um, so if you are stuck in a survival situation and you have products like this, uh, or you were going on a camping trip, got stuck, have it in your pack, hang on the pack, guys. Even if it's open and you can't close it, it can be a collector. Okay. You can um, still you can still make a what is it a uh, you can still make a clothespin out of a stick. Yeah. And you still kind of technically kind of reseal it and just stand the bag up and it's got that little bottom, so it's actually designed to sort of stand. Yeah. So it's. Definitely hang on to these things. Um, and when you guys are out here, all this trash you'll see, we, we're going to pick it up and we're going to carry it out. Like, I will show you guys. We're either going to burn off the paper stuff. This is everybody um, else's excess trash. Yeah, all the cans and stuff is not ours. <laughs> so, don't do that. Um, <coughs> don't be a litter bug. Trash. We have our own little trash. Let me show you. Not the birch court bag. Not the bird bag. Trash bag. Right here. And I'll actually carry out the trash when I leave tonight, so. Oh, all right, y'all. We, uh, oh, epically failed at all the things, including plugging the mic into the... All right, guys. Uh, we tried a live. It's not working. Um, cuts off every, like, minute and a half or so, so if that long. Uh, yeah, guys, we're just chilling and ooh, eating. Um, we tried a live. It didn't work. Uh, I'll go through and fix that on YouTube when I get back. Um, I'll try and wander around here in a little bit, see if I can find a spot. But, ooh, thank you. Uh, for now, this is what we got, so. I do apologize about that. I'll try and go up the road or something, see if I can find somewhere that has a spot by the lake or something, but this is what you get for now. <laughs> so, um, there's a lot of tree coverage in here too. Yeah, I think that had a lot to do with it with me finding that damn spot, but if you're going to get one, but they're pricey. Oh boy, I like 30 bucks. That one's 40. Oh really, that? I wonder if that. Not cast iron skillet, but they have an extra smell skillet that's not stainless. Steel. Yeah, the foldable one? Mm -hmm. No, those are actually pretty good. I used to have one. They're not bad. What about that one? This I like because I can boil water, and I'm always never bringing water out here. So, Well, everything's gotten run off because of this fire. I don't say run off for a little bit. Alright, guys. We're, uh, Steve-O's going to take off. He's got work in the morning. Um, it's probably about 9, 9.30 now. And, uh, I got everybody else who's trying to sleep, so I don't want to talk too loud and disturb them and stuff. But we got uh, had a good meal. Thank you, by the way, for that. You're welcome. <laughs> um, You're welcome. But, uh, yeah, we're going to go out and do some, some more stuff. For sure. Oh, seven weeks until summer. And then, uh, oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh, oh. I got announcements, guys. I got announcements. While you're here. I forgot. I totally forgot I was going to give you guys some announcements. I was going to do it on the live. And uh, I didn't because the live didn't work. <laughs> so, um, coming up for springtime, guys, I'm doing, uh, I'm doing workshops, fire, firecraft, shelter, uh, water purification, food gathering. I uh, have a whole bunch of a uh, whole bunch of workshops. I have uh, beginner, medium, expert uh, survival courses that are coming up. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, link down in the comments, or uh, not link down in the comments. What am I trying to say, Steve? Uh, Description. No, not link. It's not even link that I'm trying to say. Oh, right. <laughs> write down in the comments what you guys think. Um, if you guys are in Georgia, around Georgia area, Tennessee, North Carolina, anything like that, um, definitely doing some in the in the area for anybody who's interested. Uh, starting that up with the spring coming. Uh, I'm getting. I'm, I'm pumping out these videos, guys. I'm I'm running out of time. I got I got a couple months, and then uh, then my time's going to be taken up elsewhere. For, for a little bit. Um, we actually found out that we are pregnant. So me and my girlfriend are pregnant. Well, she's pregnant. I'm, I'm here emotionally supporting. So, you uh, pregnant too. Currently, right now, you're pregnant. <laughs> but we are uh, pregnant, expecting a little girl in September. So we are preparing for that. So I'm trying to pump out as many videos as I can while I can, because um, come September and a little bit before that, my time's going to be a lot more taken up, so. Um, Maybe I'll be able to fill in for some of that. There you go. Get me trained up enough, and I'll come out here. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to make him a survival expert, guys. I just got to stop being lazy and uh, wanting all the comforts. <laughs> um, you know, when I come out here, it's going to be nothing but mostly food videos. I'll go give it that. I'll be doing a lot of bushcraft camp cooking. There you go. Yeah, see? Uh, right now, as you can see, we have a, have a upside down fire, guys. I, I will put it somewhere in the screen, what it's actually called. It may be upside down fire. Um, burns a lot slower, gives off a little bit less heat. Um, but all the coals will be there for me in the morning. So I'm um, setting that up mainly because I have this tarp and I don't want to burn it. I like it too much. <laughs> I like it too, too much, guys. Um, but I will try a live tomorrow. Uh, I'm too tired to mess with electronics tonight, so we're gonna sign off here. And uh, you wanna tell them about the green flames? Oh yeah, Stephen got some uh, some funky flames. It's funky flames. Um, it's not plastic burning, I swear. No, it's uh, the funky flames from Walmart, guys. They're, they're pretty neat. Uh, yeah. You got. Green flames going, and it's a little bit of blue in there too. Yeah, a little bit of blue, a little bit of yellow. Well, yellow is the main flame, but yeah. Green All right, blue, you know what? Green and blue is the main colors. I'm tired. <laughs> it's past my bedtime. I know it's past my bedtime. I'm getting old, guys. Getting old. Um, old man. I am. I turned 30 in July, man. I'm becoming old. I'm not becoming old. I'm not becoming old. Oh, um, welcome to the club. But uh, we're going to sign off, and yeah, steve going to head home, uh, no. and I'm probably going to sit here and stare into the green flames, and then I'm going to crawl into my nice double double uh, sleeping bagged up hammock and try and get some good rest. I'll let you guys know how that goes in the morning. All right. Yeah, guys, we're out. Uh, Y'all have a great night, and we will see you, well, I'll see you in the morning. Peace.